Carter come to you live from Arrow in Your Head Stadium in Carter City, Missouri. Now, fans have been partying and tailgating all day long by filling up on their major food groups, beef, pork, Budweiser beer. And jello salad with many mutant marshmallows. It's the best, Grim. Simply delicious. Today's matchup promises severed limbs and ruined careers and lots of lots of beers. The Crooks and Skull Jugulars battle the Carcass City Creeps. Welcome to MFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. Welcome to MFL Sunday School, where the good playbook teaches it's an eye for no reason, a tooth for an eight ball, and a limb for just looking at me the wrong way. MFL game day is on the air. Grim Blitzrow, my partner's Bricks and Bricks Jr. Hey man, these guys flat out want to kill each other today. Yeah, these are the kind of games families come out to see. It's good for the sport. You know what I like about this home team is 90% of them were born criminally insane. You can't teach that. Mama, just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. His only chance is... <laughs> oh, wow. If you're a defender, the only good QB is a dead one, Bricks. Ah, oh, he must be pretty good then, because he is dead. <laughs> and it's first and ten. Hot, hot one... Nice hit! Second down and nine. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're gonna dump his ass. Needs a miracle. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. He scores! Uh, this dance team doesn't translate quite as well in normal gravity, but he's doing his best. Better than you could do. Your dancing is like a death rattle of an overdose meth addict. Oh, you an apology, Bricks. It does hurt when Junior's mean. Well, let's start a support group, Grim. Well, this should be an easy chip shot extra point, but you never know with kickers. <laughs> hey. Straight through the uprights. The teams are lined up for the kickoff. Sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Second down and ten. Oh, the defender just knocked the ball loose. Now that'll wake you up, then put you to sleep permanently. You snooze, you lose. Yeah, unless you're in a sleeping contest. Third down and ten. Nice pass. That catch is good for six yards. Man, 
Man, this coach must have played too many video games. You gotta punt it here. Come on. How do you like your defense is cooked? The ball carrier is saying, well done. Bang, baby, bang. Opa! He's got his flame on working. Boom, and he's dead. Oh, bingo, bingo, bingo. I got bingo, Grim. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score. He's hit the 40. That's a touchdown saving tackle right there. Hey, uh, Bricks, check the rule book. Is that a penalty? Why would I have the rule book? Oh, for fuck's sake. And it's first and ten. Defense says enough of this BS and jumps off sides to lay waste to the referee. Way to go, guys. And it's first and ten. Second down and long. Great play by the defense results in an interception. Oh, that's a vicious hit. And the crowd loves it. He just turned a guy into 300 pounds of ground mutiny. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. First and ten. Hot one. Hot two. Hey. Second down and a lot. Hey. And that's another pick. Man, oh man, the defense is. Ouch! What a oh no, that was totally unnecessary. <laughs> I got to see that one again. It was also freaking awesome. The previous play never happened because the defense called a time warp dirty trick and transport their offense back in time. It's just a jump to the left. And a step to the right. Hot two. Hot. Hot eight. Man, what a hit that was. Third down and the punter is warming up. Hot one. Hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh man, the offense called a murder ball. It's a little on the nose, don't you think? It's your first down. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. Second down and five. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Third down and a pussy hair. He had nowhere to go 
one got nothing out of it. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross pitching, unbelievable. It's anyone's game still at this point. I know, which makes it so hard to place a bat. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. He's got the ball now. Let's see what he does with it. Oh, great tackle. When his brain is unscrambled, he'll be thinking about that hit. Yeah, most likely in a confer was it home. And it's first and ten. I, I, one, I, two. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. Second down and ten. Hot one, hot two. Eight. And the passing game picking up some steam. A gain of seven there. Third down and three. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. Boom, dead and down. He delivered the freaky fast ham a sandwich with extra mustard for the death blow. Speaking of ham sandwiches, I'm gonna go grab one. You want anything? No, still working on my salami here, Briggs. Thanks. That's what she said. <laughs> that time. It was close, though. Yep. And it's first and ten. Oh, and he might have just saved a touchdown on that deflection. Second down and ten. And the defense puts one over on the quarterback with a sticky ball dirty trick. Oh, and they just deflated the quarterback's balls right there. Third down and, well, good luck. That's a catch for a 10-yard gain. Boring, but smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Apparently, the punter for the day is being played by... They just let that one drop and play it safe, and the defense says we'll take it. And it's first and ten. One, two, three. The defense called a one speed dirty trick. Bam! Say goodnight to that guy, Bricks. Ah, goodnight to that guy, Bricks. You're an idiot. They run it for a yard. Second down and nine. Hot, hot one. First down. I don't know if they're his, but he sure has a good set of hands. And it's first and ten. The defense didn't give an inch. No gain on that play. Second down and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. Looks like he just saw 400 scary movies after that hit. It sounds like my off season. <laughs> and it's first and ten. <laughs> he picks up a two. And that'll be 
only second and eight to go. And the quarterback throws a murder ball, which will slice its way through any defensive player trying to block it. That's really put the button. He could go all the way. <laughs> First and ten. Caught for the first down. And it's first and ten. Two minutes left in the half. First and ten. And that's another turnover for... Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not young. <laughs> Just want to get some fun on your time. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two... They go to the ground game and pick up the first. I know how they said never hit a man when he's down. It's just plain lazy. Nice extra effort there. And it's first and ten. And he picks up four on that passing catch. Second down and six. Hot. Hot. Oh man, Brooks, you gotta love a player who goes down fighting. Oh, with the brutal hit. And he snags it for six! Touchdown! Touchdown! Mistakes here, just kick the ball through the upright for God's sake. It's good. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Destruction in his path. It's a tie game at the end of quarter two. The teams are deadlocked in a fierce struggle today. We'll be right back with today's halftime show brought to you by Monsatan Industries. Eat their delicious Franken food. Hey, during the half, can you pick me up a soil like beer? We are all tied up and set to kick off the second half. Uh, speaking of all tied up, Grim, how many of them elephant lags in a belt did I take? Uh, I feel like I'm sitting on Mount Vesuvio right now. Uh, one false move, and I'm gonna blow! <laughs> Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. They're going to be able to return this one. And it's first and ten.
second down and a very long. Oh, that was totally uncalled for. And that's why we love the MFL. <laughs> Third down and long. Oh, man, he just laid the wood on that guy. Yeah, if you're going to hit a guy that hard, you should at least kill him. Do him a favor. Look at this And out comes the most underrated position in football, the mighty punter. He boomed that one. Let's see if they can get a And he snags the punt and looks for open field. I had a dog named Snags. He got you playing cards. Oh, mama. He just knocked him into the next time zone. Once he finds his head, he'll be okay. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Good thing they have a good tension in the MFL. Because whenever they get it, he's off to the races. Look at that little. Kick it. In that order, Grim? Hey. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five! Welcome to Fumbletown, USA. Population, this guy. Well, he should be more careful when he hurdles. He's at the 10. And he picks up the loose ball and rumbles into the end zone for the score. Nice going. Well, this should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. First and ten. Ah, another interception. Jeez. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. First and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot. Ball man about a six-yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. Hot. And with another pick, the QB says, I don't always throw interceptions, but when I did... And he's wrong. One time, when I was playing, a guy hit me so hard, I went into a dark tunnel. Thought I saw my grandparents waving at me in the light. Turns out it was just the visitor's tunnel that he knocked me into, and it was the paramedics waving fingers in my face. Oh, nice time warp dirty trick called by the D, and the offense is pissed. <laughs> oh, for you kids at home, that's how you play mutant football. Hey, wait! Throws another pick. He 
should have eaten his Sweeties this morning. Boom! Oh, come on, that was a cheap shot. <laughs> That's why I love this guy. And so do the fans. And it's first and ten. Second down and more than the QB would like. wonder what made him so mad. Yeah, it was probably all the diarrhea. Well, you're probably right. Yeah, they probably ran out. And the ball razors through the defense, and he catches it for a touchdown. What a beautiful play. Yeah, and don't lose Paul on the grid like a high school. Okay, nice and easy like a two-foot putt. You miss two foot pots all the time, Grim. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was a chip wearing a wig. First and ten. Oh, with a brutal hit! Second down and long. Pow! And how about a little dirt sandwich? Third down and six. Oh. Boom to the moon. Another loser bites the dust. In the NFL, winning is really about how much you want it, Bricks. Well, he clearly didn't want to live as much as the other guy. That's a good point, Grim. And they'll line up for the punt here. Nice punt! Should move him back night, and he's got a chance for a good return here! And he fumbles it, Bricks! That was a screwed up play if I ever saw one! And it's first and ten. Team he's on? I don't even know where I'm at. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and 
ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot three. Second down in a lot. And the defense jumps off sides trying to mutilate the QB. If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Briggs? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! That's the end of the third quarter. And look, folks, I'll be honest, I don't see a chance in hell in here. And it's first and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot He refuses to go down. And they run it for a couple of yards. Whoa, mama. Just call him Cap and Crunch. Another one bites the dust. And that'll be second and eight to go. Hot one, hot two, hot two. The defender says, I don't think so. Third down and eight. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, hot, hot. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep, third grade. Sister Mary Margaret of Our Ladies of Holy Hell. I thought it was brass knuckles, hot. but it was just a regular knuckles. Hot two. Hot. 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 The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs, Grim. Yep, the defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick and the QB is in a heap of trouble now. Second down in a very long. And that pass is good for about five yards. Third down and nine. Hot, hot one, hot two. At this point, with multiple interceptions, the QB should just throw in the towel. Yeah, he'd probably have it intercepted, though. Pow! With the brain scrambler, with the vicious kill. Did you know light hits are one of the leading causes of death for mutants over 25? I didn't know that. Yeah, right below attending bachelor parties and owning a Sam Schwong Galaxy phone. And like every one of my barbecues, this guy's on fire. Does he like original or extra crispy? Now it looks like extra crispy. <laughs> Boom, dead and down. He just sent a message with that hit. Yeah, the message was you can't kill the messenger because he's going to kill you. But then he won't be able to read the message because the messenger killed him. Ah, uh, going in circles. And that was a bone crusher right there, folks. And it's first and ten. That's a run for no gain. Second down and ten. Hot, hot one, hot two, hot, 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 hot. This guy's a brick shit house. Third down and Hunter is warming up. He was stuffed at the line of scrimmage. So is that cheerleader. Well, here comes the punting unit. You know, punters really do know how to party, Bricks. Yeah? Oh, yeah, I have pictures that, uh, well, maybe actually shouldn't discuss it. Nice catch, and it turns on the afterburners. Punt returners in this league have a life expectancy of three. Boom! Oh, you knew you were going to see a lot of...
of carnage today, folks. These teams have bad blood between them. Apparently, they got it from the same blood mobile that usually parks outside next to the taco truck. Raccoon Raby blood is my thought. Always a player's favorite. The defense better watch out. The quarterback just threw a murder ball. And there's an eight-yard catch. Chipping away with those medium passes. I like it. Like a patient prison break. And the offense goes into the hurry-up formation to try to conserve time. The defense calls a sticky ball dirty trick. The quarterback can't dump it. And now they're going to dump his ass. <laughs> Just one dirt and some fun on your time. Third down and, well, good luck. It's the two-minute warning. You know what that means, right, Bricks? Yeah, take a giant whiz and get in a fight in the next room. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. I am so confused. You've got to catch that. And the offense goes into a hurry-up to pick up the pace of the game. And the team refuses to quit. They stay alive with four new downs. And it's first and they stunt the clock with their first time out, leaving them with two in case they need them. Yeah, just like condoms, hatchets, and wives, huh, Grim? You know, you just summed up why we don't get together outside of work, Bricks. And he punched his way out of that tackle. And that is called for a first down. First down and six. The quarterback is controlling the clock right now like the clock is into it. He just clock blocked the clock. And the quarterback goes into a hurry up offense and calls all the plays from the line of scrimmage from here on out. And that's the way you play a guy. Nice coverage. And the hurry up offense wears out the defense since they can't rest their players. That's a T-yard pass play, and that's not going to get it done. The offense needs to move the ball upfield. <laughs> the quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Brent's match stupsing time. And that's another turnover for the defense. Oh, nice hit. up maybe two. Uh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hot, 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 hot. The creeps pound the opposition to hell and win it home today. After a stomping like that, the opposition may be a permanent part of the field. More like a graveyard, Grim. There are body parts everywhere. And speaking of body parts, that I am a tell well, you Let's listen to the MVP. I'm sure he has something inspiring to say. Once again, the folks at Evil SM thank our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microheart Corporation. They get it right every up.